Chennai based Madras Institute of Technology, one among the leading engineering institutes of the country. The institute was established in 1949 and merged with Anna University in 1978. The institute has been a pioneer in introducing several new areas of specialization in the field of engineering, such as aeronautical, automobile, electronics and instrument technology. Over the years, it has also accommodated courses in various other fields like rubber and plastic technology. It is the first institute in India to offer undergraduate program in aeronautical engineering and Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam, the late President of India, specialized in aeronautical engineering from this very institute. Till date, MIT Chennai is leading the way in propelling aerospace education and indigenous research in the field. The Institute's Department of Aerospace Engineering also works in collaboration with Aeronautical Research and Development Board of DRDO to develop cutting-edge technologies in the field of aeronautical engineering so that India can scale new heights in aerospace sector. This particular college started aeronautical engineering education from 1949. And after this um, funding started from Air and B way back in 1971. And uh, uh, students have been picked up uh, from the first year onwards and they were given scholarship based on the performance of their previous degree level. And they have been funded about 15 to 16 scholarships were given every year. And they have been taken into DRDO. So the funding has been, they are given the scholarships and they have picked up. Under the Center for Aerospace Research, MIT has developed several indigenous technologies for the development of unmanned air vehicles or UAVs in India. MIT's acumen in this field was witnessed and appreciated by the Missile Man of India himself. In 2020, the Institute honored Dr. Abdul Kalam by naming its Center for Advanced UAV Research after him. The aim of the center is to provide better facilities to the students for research and training in the field of UAV technology. The center is innovating upon the drone technology to expand its use in various sectors and to make India self-reliant in the field of UAV technology. The drones developed by the center have been used by many state and central agencies for applications in the field of defense, agriculture and many others. For the last five years, we are mainly concentrating on the unmanned aerial vehicle program. And uh, this is mainly due to the Tamil Nadu government support which they have given heavy funding. And based on that, we have developed uh, UAVs for the societal applications, mainly for agriculture, disaster management, then for infrastructure, um, uh, not development, infrastructure assessment, so, and uh, for surveillance for police forces. We have developed about six to seven types of UAVs. And most of the UAVs in the market are based only on battery operated. The problem with this is that it has got a limited endurance. So we have developed as a basic research, we have developed engines here. Overall, Madras Institute of Technology is serving the nation by introducing high quality academic and research programs for the students and also by providing extension services and cutting edge technologies to institutions like DRDO and ISRO.